everyone. Welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me for our daily message from our angels. And this is for Saturday, October the 5th, 2019. Yes, yes, yes. Angels, what is going on today? Yes, what is going on today, this wonderful Saturday morning? Hmm, angels, we're looking for positive energy to just two more messages, just two more. Thank you, there's one. Yes, 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 we need one more. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, remember, if this is taking too long, you know what to do, just that's it. That's it. All right. All right, angels. Just one more. Just one more message. Just one more. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Let's get right into the daily message. All right. As our feet hit the ground, we have the high priestess card reversed with the temperance card, the devil. Yes, yes, yes. The seven of pentacles reversed. The Wheel of Fortune reversed. The Six of Swords, oh my gosh, reversed. The Ten of Wands reversed. And the World card. You know what? Let's just get into this because we're just going on and on and on. Okay, so as our feet hit the ground, the High Priestess is saying, we're still, I still, I still feel like with this, we're, we're trying to go within. We're trying to deeply tap into who we are as a person, as a spirit on this journey. The temperance is saying we are we are really, really um, having patience with ourselves. We're having patience with ourselves. And the devil card is saying, I feel like we're having patience about um, something that we are attached to that we may not want to be attached to anymore. And the seven of, the seven of pentacles reversed is saying that which we were attached to and it could be a person place or thing whatever it was that we were attached to we're not we're no longer seeing the value in that of what we were not attached to anymore why because the wheel of fortune the wheel of fortune has turned so everything um attached to what wasn't working in the past what was working in the past is no longer working in the past and it's like a universal thing I feel like we, with the six of, of swords, we, I feel like mentally we keep going back to that. We keep going back to the thoughts that were around um, something that was emotionally destructive in our life, but we know that we can move forward. We know that we can move forward with ease if we allow, um, I feel like as we move forward with ease, the, you will have everything that the world has to offer. Yes, 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 but don't worry. Do not worry, the universe is definitely going to give you everything that you need. Yes, and I think that you already know it. We already know it. So yes, we're, we're having patience. We're having patience with ourselves about something that we were codependent on, addicted to. Could be cigarettes, chocolate, relationships, um, just things that you know we knew we shouldn't be doing, okay? All right, but or maybe we didn't know that we shouldn't be doing. Maybe we were just doing it, okay? Some of us, some of us know we shouldn't be doing it, okay? So, but we no longer see the value in that. Maybe, maybe it was um, smoking, maybe it was chocolate, maybe it was soda, things of that nature. But we no longer see the value in it because it's no longer worthwhile to us. But that doesn't mean we don't, we're still thinking about it. We are still thinking about it, but we're willing to let it go so that we can have free up our time to do something else more constructive don't worry, don't worry. It's all gonna work out and you're gonna get a solid mind moving forward, okay? So I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.